Hello everyone. Welcome to Metallurgical Engineering YouTube channel. Today, we are going to discuss about classifications and applications of non-ferrous metals. In this video, we will discuss the different categories of non-ferrous material and its important applications. We will discuss the extraction process of each non-ferrous metals in upcoming videos. Please suggest us topics from your side in the comments section. For any doubts, please visit our Instagram and Facebook page. Let's start the video. We have classified non-ferrous metals in nine categories. 1. Primary metals. 2. Secondary metals. 3. Light metals. 4. Precious metals. 5. Refractory metals. 6. Scattered metals. 7. Radioactive metals. 8. Rare earth metals. 9. Ferroalloy metals. Some other types are alkali metals and alkaline metals. Primary metals are copper, lead, zinc, tin and nickel. These metals are extensively used in our daily life and these metals are second in important to iron. Applications of copper metal are in electricals, buildings, engineering and transport, specially used in wires, making brass and bronze. Lead has applications in batteries, pipes, sheets, gasoline additive and alloying element for solder alloy. Applications of zinc are in galvanizing the steel sheet, used in die casting, for making alloys, sheet, and wires. Applications of tin are in to make tin plate, maca solder alloy and in chemical industries. Application of nickel metal are in stainless steels, non-ferrous alloys, high temperature alloys and in electroplating. Secondary metals are antimony, cobalt, cadmium and mercury. These metals are mainly byproducts of primary metals but also form their own deposits. Application of antimony are in batteries, pigments, fire retardants, rubbers and plastics. Cobalt are used in making alloys, magnets, for paint dryers, used in ceramic and catalysis. Mercury are used in caustic chlorine cells, batteries, electricals, biocidal paints, instrument and dental. Cadmium are used in plating, pigments, plastic stabilizer and NECD batteries. Light metals are beryllium, magnesium, aluminium and titanium. These metals have low specific gravity, below 4.5. They are active metals and difficult to prepare. Beryllium has applications in electric, electronics industry, nuclear reactors and in aerospace. Aluminium are used in buildings, automotive, aerospace, electricals and packaging sectors. Magnesium metals are used as reducing agent, as an oxide for refractories, for fertilizer and biomedical sectors. Titanium is used in jet engine, chemical industry, rockets and making implants for human body. Precious metals are gold, silver, platinum and palladium. These are mainly used in maker cavy jewelry. Other applications are shown here. Refractory metals of vanadium, chromium, tungsten and molybdenum. Scattered metals are germanium, gallium, indium, sc, hf. Applications of scattered metals are in semiconductors, nuclear reactors, photoelectric cells and refractory metals. Radioactive metals are uranium, thorium, mainly used in nuclear reactors for producing electricity.
rare earth metals are yttrium, gadolinium, lanthanum, cerium, praseodymium. These metals are used in nuclear industry, as a deoxidizer, as a catalyst, make a better X-ray source and used in fiber optics and synthetic gem. Ferroloy metals are the last category of non-ferrous metals. Examples of these type of metals are chromium, manganese, boron and silicon. These metals are used in steel industries as a deoxidizers and also used in protective coatings. Silicone are used in making semiconductors and solar cells. Manganese are used as a alloying element on aluminum and copper. Thank you for watching this video. Please like and share this video and subscribe our channel.